Tell us about Don Swanson's paper from what was it? I think the 80s or something about undiscovered public knowledge. Tell us about that. Yeah, so so Don Swanson, yeah, he's this information scientist in the 1980s. He wrote this paper called Undiscovered Public Knowledge. And he, he's, he begins kind of like with a thought experiment. He says, okay, imagine somewhere in the scientific literature, there's a paper that says A implies B. And then somewhere else in the literature, it could be in the same field, um, it could be an entirely different field. Um, there's another paper that says B implies C. And so if you had connected them together, you would say, oh, maybe in fact, A implies C. But because the scientific literature is so vast, no one has actually been able to read these two papers. And so that that knowledge, the connection was undiscovered, but it was public because it was out there. And so it's one of these things where if we actually had ways of stitching together all the scientific knowledge that was out there, we would actually be able to make new discoveries that were kind of just lying out there, ready for the taking. Um, the interesting thing with Swanson is that he was not content with leaving this as a thought experiment. He actually tried to, to test it in, in the real world. And he used I mean, the, the then cutting edge technology, which was I think like using keyword searches and on like the Medline database. But he actually found this relationship between, I think it was consuming fish oil and then helping treat some sort of circulatory disorder. Uh, and then he was, I think he was able to publish it in a, in a medical journal, even though he himself had no medical training, um, which was kind of wild. Uh, and so, and I think with all, like, yeah, with a lot of these AI tools, we are now going to be able to kind of stitch together lots of different ideas uh, and kind of navigate this, like the latent space of knowledge or however you want to describe it in a way that has really never before been possible.